Welcome or welcome back to my faith and lifestyle channel, All Things Life, where we are here for today's video, okay? This strawberry Tarani syrup, just in time for February, the love month. I am so super excited. I saw this in Marshalls and I just had to pick it up. It's very rare that I see Tarani strawberry syrup in store here. So when I got this, I was super excited for only $7. You can't beat that, but I will link this in the description box below because I know that they do sell this at Amazon, on Amazon. So I will link this. Everything that I use today, if it is from Amazon, I will link it below. But nevertheless, I digress. Let's get into this. I want to make some quick drinks, um, something that we already have in the house. I didn't want to go out and buy a lot of uh, stuff to make these drinks because I wanted to make sure that I like this syrup first. Uh, it's Valentine's month. It's Valentine's day. Me and my man, my man, my man, <laughs> you know, going to celebrate this month. So I want to let you guys know how this tastes, how sweet it is, and I'm going to make it with some ingredients that you already have at your house. So let's get into it. Drink number one will be a strawberry lemonade. We all know that strawberry lemonade is very good, but to make it at home is even better because you save lots of money. So since I have not opened this yet, I'm going to smell this. Ooh, it smells very very good it makes me think of strawberry soda this is what this smells like so what i'm going to do to each drink i'm going to add two tablespoons of strawberry syrup i already have my ice in the cups so this strawberry lemonade is going to have two tablespoons and let me get my lemonade I made this lemonade, you know, what I had, I thought I had some country time and I didn't. So I was looking in the refrigerator, y'all, and I was like, okay, what can I do to make some lemonade real quick? I didn't have any lemonade Kool-Aid, which I would have used, but what I did have was this real lemonade concentrate, read the directions on the back, made me some lemonade, boom, bam, there you go. So I slightly made this slightly sweet. I didn't make it too, too sweet um, because I want to see how sweet the actual strawberry syrup is. So I just add it to taste. I kind of eye it um, because I want my strawberry syrup to be the star of the show. So very pretty color. Strawberry lemonade. Let me put me a little garnish at the top here to be a little bougie. And let's try this one out. Oh my God, that's, oh, no, I'm not even kidding y'all. That is very, very good. I only added two tablespoons of the strawberry syrup, some lemonade, made from this reading the directions on the back simple as that <laughs> 10 out of 10 10 out of 10. all right let's go to the next drink i was looking at some videos on youtube and i was like what can i use to make with this strawberry syrup and somebody had a strawberry tea now, I've had never had this in a restaurant, didn't even know that it was a thing, but apparently it is. So I made me some tea, simple black tea, nothing fancy, nothing out of the box, sweet tea. I slightly made it sweet, didn't make it too sweet. Put it in my glass bottle. And by the way, these glass bottles are also off of Amazon. When I juice, I use these bottles and they keep it so fresh. It's so convenient. They're very lightweight and they're very durable. So I'll link those two. All right. Nice, pretty color on those. Let's make a stir. I'm so happy about that strawberry lemonade. I, I'm, I'm so happy about that. All right. Let's see how this, oh, 
Mm-mm, y'all. Y'all told you remember I'm bougie. I'm bougie. Let me put my little garnish strawberry. So cheers to strawberry tea. very very good i've tasted the tea infused with the strawberry it doesn't give like this weird taste it just tastes like a combined fruit drink i mean the black tea is not a harsh tea um you can put black tea with a lot of things so i'm very excited to know that now for you tea lovers you can have a drink and it doesn't have to be coffee that is very good 10 out of 10. Okay. On to the third drink. Y'all, we winning today. We are winning with this strawberry syrup. Again, I'm only using two tablespoons of syrup in each drink. And this one is going to be a club soda. Um, but this is not something that I usually would order. It's pretty common. It's a classic. And I figured, you know, hey, it would be great to do a strawberry club soda. Let's see what this will taste like instead of having to buy a whole case of soda that I'm not really gonna drink like that. So, two tablespoons of strawberry syrup. Let's get our garnish so that we won't forget. And then I'm gonna get my club soda. I forgot to put that in my little stash over here, so let me get that club soda. All right, so I got my club soda. You know, again, this is not something that I usually buy, but I love me a good fizz. I love me a good soda. And we're going to check this out. I'm gonna fill it just to where I think my preference would be. Isn't that so pretty? Oh, I'm so happy that I bought this. Y'all, y'all, I'm telling you, y'all got to go get this strawberry uh, syrup off of Amazon or wherever you can find it. Again, I found mine at Marshall's. Marshall's. So be on the lookout when you're at Home Goods, TJ Maxx, Marshall's, Ross, any of those um, types of stores. If you don't find it there, I'm telling you, go to Amazon. They got it. All right. Y'all know she pretty. Y'all know that strawberry soda club soda is pretty. Pretty. Got the fizz going. All right, cheers. Let's see. <laughs> I don't even know what to say. Strawberry soda classic. That's a 20 out of 10. No, y'all listen. Everything that I've tasted so far has been absolutely amazing. I am so glad I made this purchase. I'm going to look into doing something with some coffees in another video and uh, some refreshers. So I want to really explore with this. I'm about to start making a mess, but y'all can see I'm making it work. Two tablespoons in here. Now this drink is going to be definitely different. I saw this on a YouTube video where it's called an Italian cream strawberry soda. So basically it's like a club soda. You're still gonna add your club soda, but then you're gonna add some either half and half or heavy whipping cream. You're gonna do two tablespoons of that as well. And that's gonna make, it's. I, I guess you can call it like a strawberry float if you wanna say like that, because once you add something like half and half or heavy whipping cream, it tends to bring an ice creamy kind of sweetness to it. So I'm super excited to see what this is about. So I've added my two tablespoons of syrup. Let me get to my club soda. So there are many uses you'll get out of this club soda. You know, club soda is not sweet at all. It just carries that that fizz that everybody looks for in a soda. And this is just an added bonus to put two tablespoons of heavy whipping cream. I finally made a mess, but that's okay. I digress, we are gonna bounce back because over in the ATL, we bounce back, y'all. All right, 
Let's put our garnish because we're bougie. And let's get our last straw. These are glass straws. I love them. They keep my drink cold as I sip. That is so pretty. It kind of looks like the pink drink at Starbucks. Now let's get into this Italian cream soda. I don't know y'all about this one. I'm a little scared. Okay. Oh, oh no, that, that is like a strawberry soda, but like a strawberry shake. I, I'm telling y'all, I'm not trying to lie to y'all. I'm not trying to sell you nothing. I just want y'all to know that this is a winner. You'll save lots of money. I'm so happy. Now I'm going to look into doing a coffee version with this strawberry syrup. So it's love month, y'all, and I love that I love this strawberry syrup. So I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you have any other drinks that you want to suggest or you want to see me try with this, please let me know in the description box below. This is love month, and I just want to let you know that God loves you. According to John 3, 16, God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever shall believe it in him, shall not perish, but have everlasting life. So I will end on that scripture, end on that note, and drink my drinks that I absolutely love. I rate all of these 20 over 10, 20 over 10, and they were so simple and so easy to make. So make sure you click those links in the description box below, and I will see you in the next video.